Iran set to join Shanghai Cooperation Organization as the Ezekiel 38 Confederacy continues to formulate up until the woe of the fifth trumpet when the so-called New World Order comes into being, which is when the Ezekiel 38 Confederacy will become the bear of Daniel chapter 7, with the lion of Daniel chapter 7 that will also come into being at that time being made up of Ephraim, Judah, and Manasseh, the first three kings of the south, as you can see in the Daniel 11 hypothesis on biblicalresearchlabs.com, with the fourth king of the south being the lion of Daniel chapter 7. Ephraim is the British Commonwealth, Germany is Judah, and the United States is Manasseh, but by the time the woe of the fifth trumpet occurs, Germany will have most likely become the post-Brexit leader of Europe, meaning in the new world order as it's called, Germany will be Judah, including Europe, and you can see that beginning to happen already ready more and more with articles like a European Union under German leadership and Germany aims for leading military role in Europe, as you can see linked up on mark13news.com for September 12th and 13th. As you can see in the study on Daniel chapter 8 on BibleStudyArchives.com, Germany in the World Wars is symbolized by the notable horn of the he-goat because Germany was used by the shadow government of the Kenites to bring about the United Nations, which is the great horn of the he-goat. Ephraim and Manasseh, again, are the British Commonwealth and the United States, which are symbolized by the two horns on the ram of Daniel chapter 8. So with the notable horn being Judah and the the two horns being Ephraim and Manasseh, we now know that those three horns that get plucked up by the roots whenever Satan appears as the false Christ are the Christian nations, Ephraim being the British Commonwealth, Manasseh being the United States, with Judah being Germany, including Europe, in my opinion. And it's also my opinion that the United Nations is the great horn of the he-goat, and it's when that great horn gets broken, the so-called New World Order comes into being at the woe of the fifth trumpet, when Satan and his angels get cast to earth, because Daniel's fourth beast is exclusively supernatural, the only one of the four beasts of Daniel chapter 7 that has ten horns, because they're symbolic of ten fallen angel kings that will reign with Satan throughout the entire five-month-long hour of temptation, beginning at the woe of the fifth trumpet, which is also when the Ezekiel 38 confederacy becomes the bear of Daniel chapter 7, and the he-goat becomes the leopard with the lion that comes into being at that time being the Christian nations up until those three horns get plucked up by the roots at 666 because that's when most Christians will begin worshiping the king of Babylon of the end times which is Satan and his role of Antichrist beginning the final half hour of the five month long hour of temptation or 70 evenings which is what the 70 years in captivity to the Babylon of old were a type of. <laughs> 